Bienvenidos. Welcome to the City of Corona's Community Conversations. 1968, President Lyndon Johnson declared the week of September 15th as a time to celebrate people of Hispanic descent. Events like this are the perfect way to connect and build some real relationships with our community. If you are not familiar with the Hispanic culture, well, welcome. We're going to treat you into what it is like to be Hispanic, also living here in the United States. Good evening, everyone. My name is Evita Tapia Gonzalez. I'm the Chief of Communications for Corona Norco Unified School District. Javier Vasquez. I'm the CEO of Miguel's Restaurant. Well, my parents came to Corona and they opened Miguel's 1973. My name is Eddie Nunez. I'm the CEO and President of Herencia Maria Che Academy. It's a nonprofit. At school. We opened this school because I know there's a lot of families that don't have the means to go somewhere else and travel to have music lessons. And that's what we're here to prove that we as Hispanics, Mexican Americans, we can do it. No one can stop us. There's so much beauty in our culture, but it's also punctuated with some pain. And I think acknowledging that pain can only be done, you know, through conversations like this. It's these values that we identify with. If you identify with what you learn from your parents, hard work, perseverance, and dedication to the family, and carry on traditions that they taught us, and then of course paying taxes. I'm always doing that. You know, I think the Latino culture, the tapestry of the American traditions, the Latino heritage and Hispanic heritage are so much a part of that. There's a story that those songs bring and talk about us, and a lot of people can relate as family to keep that tradition going and be proud of who we are. For me, I think the obvious answer is food. Through food is how you express culture, express the love. We'll pass on from generation to generation through our, through our food. Aventurero, el mundo me importa poco. Cuando una mujer me gusta, me gusta pesar de todo.